Hello, hello, welcome to chapel. Yeah. Look who I have here. Ta-da. Yeah, I bet you don't know who this is. This is my old friend, Theo. Yay. He, um, how are you doing? Oh, I'm doing just fine. Yeah, I'm so glad you're back. Oh my goodness, it's so much fun to be back. Right. I used to come here at chapel. You did. Yeah. You did. You totally did. Theo was a regular guest of ours a few years back, and then he and his family moved away. Well, now they're back, and he decided to come by for a visit, and I'm super excited that he's able to join me today for chapel. Yeah. Yeah. We're going to be talking about responsibility. That's a part of accountability, and it's important for us to know what that means. So we're going to talk about that. Theo, are you ready? Oh, my goodness. Yes, yes. Yeah, Wait, very you, good. And you, you said accountability? Accountability, yeah. And this week, we're going to focus on responsibility. Oh. Um, the last time you came... Gosh, you were a few years younger. I don't know if you had many responsibilities then. Well, no, because when I was like a little puppy, like I, I, I would just, uh, my parents would pick yeah. up my toys. Right. And my, my parents would feed me. Right. But, but now when, that I'm an older puppy, um, I, I play with my toys. And then guess what? I put, I put them away. That's right. I'm a big puppy. That's right. I have a favorite squeaky yeah. toy, and, <laughs> and I have to put it away when I'm done. Yep. Yeah. Well, that's part of what we're going to talk about, responsibilities, and how when you're a baby, you don't really have a lot of responsibilities. In fact, you don't really have any. Babies just kind of grow. That's their job. But as they get older, they have more and more responsibilities, just like what you were talking about. Now that you're older... You're yeah. responsible for picking up your toys. Yeah. Right? Yeah. And, yeah. And, and sometimes sometimes when we're done eating, I, I, I'll put my, my food bowl and my water bowl in the dish, That's the dishes. Right. Yeah. That's right. The dirty and dishes. I bet you have a few more responsibilities than your younger sister. I, I do. Right. Yeah. 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 Theo has a younger sister. I remember she was just yeah. a tiny baby. Oh, she was left. a puppy puppy. Now That's she's just right. a puppy. Yeah. 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 But I bet you have a few more responsibilities than she does. Yeah. Oh, you know? You're right. Yep. 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 Yeah. Well, that's part of what we're talking about. As we grow, we have more and more things that we are responsible about. That's a part of growing up, you know? Yeah. Oh, well, Miss Stephanie, yeah. when, when, when you were a little a puppy, I, I, mean, I, mean, <laughs> <laughs> I mean, when you were a little girl, did you have responsibilities too? I did. Yeah. When I was little, you know, my mom gave me some jobs like what you were talking about. I had to make my bed or I was certainly responsible for picking up my toys. And then as I got into school, I was responsible for doing my homework and, um, you know, making sure that I made good choices while I was at school with regard to my behavior and my relationships with my friends, you know? Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, and now, as I'm an older person, I still have responsibilities. Responsibilities don't really go away. <gasps> they don't? They don't. They oh. really don't. You're always responsible for something. In fact... God tells us about that in the Bible. He, he does. He does. He really does. Ooh. I'm going to tell you the Bible verse, Theo, and I'm going to show it to my me. friends. Galatians chapter 6, verse 5 says, For we are each responsible for our own conduct. What about that? That means oh. we're responsible for what we choose to do. Ooh. Yeah. So I'm responsible for taking care of the things that I have in my home. I'm responsible for my job here. You're responsible for your, what, water bowl and your... Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It, but, but I also go to, to, to school. Yes. Yes. I, I learn to, to wag my tail and go. to bark on command. Like, <laughs> here, try, try, try. <laughs> okay. I'm, All right. Are you ready? I'm, okay. Phew. I'm ready. Mark. Ruff, 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 ruff. <laughs> See? Good. See? Good. That I'm was learning great. To do that and not just, you know, just run around the house and be all crazy. Yeah. <sighs> it's important to learn those things. School's important. We have responsibilities there as well. And I'm sure yeah. you guys as students know that you have responsibilities with regard to the work that you do and the way that you behave. Yeah. Um, and we talked about last week having people come alongside us and hold us accountable for our behavior, um, like an accountability partner. Your parents are kind of like that, right, Theo? Yeah, yeah, they help me out. 
yeah, when, when I get too crazy and I start running around the house and I go, woof, 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 they're like, easy, calm down. <laughs> right, yeah. they come alongside and help. Yeah. Well, teachers are like that here at school. They come alongside and they help you learn. And for me, I have people that help me be accountable in my job. But the thing that really helps me most is my relationship with Jesus. Ooh. Jesus holds me accountable by helping me learn through his word. Um, just like it says in the Bible now, we're all responsible for that. We're responsible for how we learn and grow. Me too, me too. Yes, you too, you too, sir. Oh, boy. Yeah, yeah. And God will always help you, Theo, just like he helps me and just like he's going to help all of our students and staff here at St. John's. Oh, that's so much fun. Well, thank you for telling me about that. You're welcome, and I'm super glad you came to visit me at chapel. Yeah. I hope you'll come back again. <gasps> I would love to. Can I? That'd be good. That'd be good. I would love it. Oh, I boy. would super love it. I can't wait for Miss Nancy to see you. Yeah. Yeah, she'll be very happy to see you, Theo. All right, well, let's pray and get ready to go, okay? Okay, thank okay. you. Okay. Yeah. Jesus, I just want to say thank you so much for all that you do for us here at St. John's and for all of us um, everywhere, really. Thank you for the beautiful weather we're having. Thank you for all that you have done for us here at our school, allowing us to come every day and be with our friends and teachers. Jesus, I ask that you would help us as we make choices about our conduct and, and our jobs, our responsibilities. Help us to remember that we're all able and willing to do all that you have prepared for us. Lord, um, keep everyone safe. Please help those that are helping others that are ill and, and uh, that are suffering from the coronavirus. Lord, I pray that you will help us uh, as we go through the rest of our day. We say this prayer in Jesus' name, amen. 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 Very good. Yeah. Okay, well, I hope you guys have a wonderful Wednesday, and I look forward to seeing you next week. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.